Um, so, how's your office? It's going good, just back home in Tennessee, uh, hitting the throwing, starting to get back into the swing of things, uh, putting the cleats on a little bit, so it's been good. What's been the focus? Um, right now, for me, just trying to do a little bit of tweaking a little bit with the swing, trying to get the ball in the air a little bit more than I did last year. Um, and just trying to get a little bit more physical, you know. Obviously, age will help with that a little bit too, so I'm not trying to rush it, but uh, just doing a little bit with the swing, trying to get the ball in the air a little bit more. When we talked to you at the end of the minor league season, you kind of kept emphasizing the baseball is baseball, no matter mm -hmm. where you are, what yeah. affiliate you're at, things yeah. like that. How has that kind of mentality helped you? Yeah, so, you know, obviously, the game doesn't change no matter where you go. Obviously, the players are going to get better as you go up. So you uh, you know kind of what you're stepping into as far as how the game operates and stuff like that. But, you know, pace of play, and you don't want to try and let any of that change. But obviously, you know, you gotta, you're got going to have better pitching, better players, better everything. So you just got to kind of try and, you know, rise to that but not let it get too big, not, you know, let the moment get too big for you. There's been an interesting transformation from where you came from to where you are now in terms of expectations, right, mm -hmm. and external expectations. Now all of a sudden you're top 25 prospect in all of this. Mm -hmm. How do you deal with the level of expectations that are coming to um, You know, I try not to look at any of that stuff. You know, I, I try not to think too much about expectations, I guess, you know, just trying to do my thing and uh, whatever happens, happens. You know, I'm going to always give 100%. And, Whatever happens out of that's gonna happen. You know, I'm not gonna try and set a bar of what I gotta get to. You know, I'm just gonna get all I have, and you know, we'll see what happens out of that. When we talked to you on the last show, you said one of your focuses this offseason was gonna be gaining some weight. Mm -hmm. Have you? I, I'm trying, man. <laughs> I, 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 I've gained a little bit of weight, as, uh, definitely since the season ended last year. Um, I'm at a comfortable weight. I feel really good. Um, and like I said earlier about age and stuff, I, I think is. I get older, I'm going to gain some weight, so I'm not trying to force it, but, you know, I'm definitely, I feel more physical. It's better kind of weight, more it muscle is, mass. Sure. And, yeah, yeah, I'm definitely stronger than I was. Okay. Like. What did that last little bit of experience at Frisco be for you? Um, you know, it was really cool to kind of see a different, um, obviously, Carlos and Hai was amazing with the manager there. Um, but just, you know, it's a level up, it's a different style of player, one step closer to the big league, so it gets a little bit more, um, I guess, on your own rather than you know instructional i guess um it was it was really cool you know and the guys there they were already there they did a great job welcoming me in and tom too you know just uh open arms you know great personalities and you know you try not to disrupt the culture that was already there just kind of trying to mold into it so uh they did a great job letting us come in on that